hard to imagine you could improve on the scenery of the Peak District, but with aerial photography, I believe you can. It gives you a completely new perspective. And a new perspective is exactly what you need when it comes to monitoring the moorland for the impacts of visitors or for fire damage. Aerial views of patches of vegetation without the need to hire a helicopter or a plane. Heather is an alien species here, and so is the red grouse that depends on it. And here is a sequence you could only get by using a drone. On the other side of the valley, on the slope of Wynn Hill, lies the Thornhill Cars Nature Reserve. We use drone aerial footage as part of a multimedia documentary to put it on the map for Derbyshire Wildlife Trust. Like this one along the River Derwent stand as icons of the Industrial Revolution. They lend themselves to some quirky imagery. Property is another practical application of drone photography, whether for sales, for roof inspections, for looking at hard to reach places like the top of glass roofs, conservatories, or for commercial planning purposes. I'm Steve Shelley, this is my eye in the sky and you have been in the front row.